An uptick in crime in a Fargo neighborhood has one woman speaking out. Her garage was broken into, her possessions stolen. Valley News Team's Nashe Taylor brings us her story. Police typically tell you not to leave your valuables in your garage. And for Jenna Pierce, she wound up paying the price. We noticed right away my scooter was gone. Um, our scooter, we have a motorcycle and a scooter. Uh, these thieves would have noticed that they went through everything in my garage. It is believed the thieves pulled off the siding and slid into the garage. Life is not about materials. Um, you take memories with you. You don't take items. Just kind of keep saying to myself, it's ours. It's not yours to take. And we're the type of people that we would help you with anything. Um, just ask. This particular neighborhood includes East Gateway Drive Circle, an area Jenna says has never had much of a problem. But back in March, there were two shootings and a robbery close by. We've noticed that in the neighborhood, there's been some changes probably in the course of the last six months. I don't know what the heck is going on. And I think it's just time for us to move. Jenna says some tools and paperwork were also stolen from her car. The thieves were caught on camera and the property owner has since turned over the footage to police. At this point, no arrests have been made. In Fargo, Nishay Taylor, Valley News Live. The building where Jenna lives also had break-ins into the laundry room and resident mailboxes within the last five days. All situations have been reported to Fargo PD. Now, if you need help with an issue in your community, here's some advice. Call our whistleblower hotline. The phone number is there on your screen, 701-237-6576. Call that number and leave your tip. A member of our investigative team will get on the case and go to work to expose the truth.